Hey guys, so this is Normal here for Technic and today we will see the new features in Windows 8.1 update. So this update was uh, announced by Microsoft at the build conference and this comes with uh, quite a lot of new features, uh, interesting updates to existing features and also improvements to existing features. So uh, this update uh, will be rolled out on April 8 to all Windows 8.1 and 8 users. So we'll have a quick look at uh, what's new in this uh, update. So first step, uh, Microsoft added, has added the option to boot to desktop by default. So with Windows 8.1, you had the option to select whether you want to boot to directly to desktop when you start uh, Windows 8.1. Now with uh, this update, uh, boot to desktop is by default and whenever you boot the PC, it will be automatically booted to desktop. So that's a very handy feature if you have been using uh, Windows 7 and this, this feature uh, is pretty handy because it will directly boot to desktop instead of the start screen. Second up, uh, you have uh, the power options in the start screen. So previously, Windows 8.1 didn't have the power options in the start screen. Instead, you had to right click the start menu, I mean start button, or use the chance menu to open the power options. Now with the 8.1 update, you have the sleep, shutdown, and the restart option directly integrated into the start screen. So users can just click this button and uh, navigate to sleep, uh, shutdown, or restart. So this is pretty handy option, this is really useful tool um, added in the start screen. So third feature is that uh, you can now pin uh, Windows Store apps to the uh, taskbar. So you can see when you, when, once you finish the installation of this update, you can see that Windows Store will be available in the start uh, uh, taskbar and you can easily open it from the taskbar. So this is uh, another added feature in uh, Windows 8.1 update. Along with this feature, you can now close uh, Windows uh, Store apps as well. So you can see if you hover to the top of this um, Windows app, uh, you can see the close button. So you can minimize and close uh, the Store apps. So any app which is installed from the Windows Store can be closed uh, directly using the close button. So this is an, a new addition to uh, Windows 8.1. Apart from that, if you right click a tile on uh, Windows 8.1 8 start screen, you have the option to unpin from the start, unpin from the taskbar uninstall the app, resize the time and also turn off uh, live updates. Uh, so this feature was previously available elsewhere. And apart from that you can also uh, select multiple tiles using the control option and then move it across uh, and uh, rearrange them. This is again pretty useful for keyboard and mouse users instead of uh, using the touch screens. Along with this, uh, you can see that uh, taskbar is now visible on the uh, start screen as well. So you can view the um, uh, running apps on the taskbar from here. When you install a new new app, you can see that it will be highlighted so that you can, it, it will be easy to find the newly installed app from the list of all the apps uh, on uh, your Windows 8.1 PC. So these apps are highlighted and you, you can easily find them once uh, the installation is complete. So these are some of the new features uh, available in uh, Windows 8.1 uh, update 1. So this will be rolled out uh, on April 8th for all uh, users and it's free of cost and available through Windows 2. So that's all guys. Uh, if you like this video, hit the like button, subscribe for more videos like this and finally thanks for watching this video.